Welcome Hi guys. to another <laughs> story time. So this week, we're gonna tell you guys how we stopped talking for three months. If you guys watched our uh, other video, we mentioned about a piece of the puzzle that we were gonna tell you guys one day. Today is that day. So if you haven't seen that video, click the link, we'll have it down below or right here. Um, just go and watch that video and it'll tell you just a background story about us. So just to get into this video, we stopped talking for three whole months, y'all. Three. Months. three. Like, no communication whatsoever, no talking, no Zero, texting, just, nada. nothing. Like, well, actually, you text me. Yeah, so I'm gonna tell you guys what happened with me texting Tayshawn. We had a big falling out before the Indiana State Fair here. And if you guys know anything about Indiana, the State Fair is a big event. We planned on going to the State Fair together. Tayshawn did something that just took me over the edge. So I told him, like, I'm not going with you to the State Fair. I don't wanna talk no more, but, in my defense, girls do that so that the guy can chase her, not turn it back and go the other way. So when I said that, I thought he was gonna keep texting me and saying like, what's wrong, calling me. He probably called me like twice or three times. And then he might have texted me like once or twice, but then it wasn't like what I was expecting. Cause I'm used to like, oh, text message after text message, like 10 text messages, I'm coming to get you, something. He didn't do none of that. It was like, that's it. So I was like, okay. Cool. He want to be, you know, he want to keep it how it is. It is what it is. So he ended up showing up to my house to pick me up still for the fair. Now, I couldn't go because technically I was on punishment. So it was like I was young. So I was like, I don't know, like 17, 18. And I was still on punishment. So my, my dad was like, my mom said, where are you going? I said, well, I was going to go to the fair with my friends. And so my mom was like, well, I'll try to figure something out. Long story short, my dad was like, no, <laughs> no, I'm in trouble, she's in trouble, no. So I couldn't tell him that because I didn't want to be embarrassed by telling him my dad put me on punishment. So when he pulled up, I just like ran outside real quick and I was like, no, I'm not going with you. You should have, you know, handled the situation that happened. We wouldn't be here. So we're arguing, but it's only to cover up that I really can't go. So, so when he, he was like, okay, whatever, he sped off. And that was it. So I texted him trying to make small talk. Of course he didn't respond. And I was like, okay, I'll just leave it alone for a couple of days. So I let it go for like a day or two and then I text him again. And he wasn't responding y'all like at all. Like nada, did not respond. And I knew his schedule. I knew what he was doing at work, what hours he went to work. So I'm like, okay, I know he's at work right now. But however, we used to text all the time while he was at work. So he never responded back. He never reached out. So three months went by and I was texting him literally every day at the same time. Literally every single day at the same time. Talk about determination. I was determined. I was like, yes, I'm gonna get him back. Let me tell you, <laughs> this man is crazy. So he never responded and I don't even remember exactly. Well, I know what happened, What? how we ended up back talking. He just like randomly texted me like, I want to introduce you to my mom and he was gonna make me his official girlfriend on 11, 11, 11. <laughs> And so when he noticed that I was just like, by this time I had just like forgotten about the relationship. I was like, you know, it is what it is at this point. He just doesn't want to be with me, so I'm gonna move on. So when he seen that, he was like, hey, I want you to be my girlfriend. I want to introduce you to, I want to introduce you to my mom. So I'm thinking it's all a joke. I was like, I can't trust this. I don't believe it. But then it actually was true. So yeah. So my side of the story, man, pretty much. Uh, yeah, I, we were supposed to go to the fair. Uh, and so I left my mom house, which is gonna be a whole nother video. The next video probably gonna be about how I left my mom house, how we left our mom house, she left her mom house too. Uh, but I, I just felt like I wasn't, I felt like I was at a time in my life where I feel like I didn't have time to play games. So we said we was going to the fair, I didn't take off work. And when I say I worked, like I worked like, dang near 18 hours a day I think because I had two jobs so I worked like 18 hours a day so I didn't have time to like play around and, like my, my time was like valuable to me it, it still is but at that time it was like man time is money you know what I'm saying uh, so I didn't have time to play games so I felt like she was just playing games when I, I pull so this way I, I pull up to her house <laughs> and so I pull up she she comes out the house opens the door and was like I'm not going I'm like, what you mean you're not going? Just get in the car and we stop playing. We ain't got time. She's like, no, I'm not going. I'll talk to you later. Bye. And close the door. 
So then I ain't text her. I ain't, like I ain't. She said one time I didn't text her at all. Zero zip. Not I. You know what I'm saying? I didn't at all. Zero. I did not text her back. You know what I'm saying? Uh, so that's kind of how it happened. So we like I didn't text her back for like three months. Literally like three months. And then one day she, cause she used to text me like every day, the same day, same time type of thing. And uh, at, at one time I, I was just like, I'm gonna text her back because I, I feel like I was bored at work or something like that. I don't know what I was doing. Uh, but yeah, so anyway, man, if you like this video, man, comment in the comment section below. Let us know what other videos you would like us to talk about. If it's a story time that you guys would like to hear, let us know in the comment section below. If you like this video, give this video a thumbs up, man. Uh, subscribe to our channel if you have not subscribed. We're trying to get you guys with content constantly throughout the week. Uh, so yeah, we love you guys and we'll see you guys in the next video. All right. Peace. Peace.